around, study the differences. And um, if you were to have uh, Muhammad, Jesus, Moses, Abraham, peace be upon them, all in the same room, they wouldn't be arguing with each other, debating each other, because they were all on the same team. They had the same message. They had the same Lord. But many times, it's the people, it's us that get this message confused. <laughs> But saying won't get you to know if you know what I'm saying. Uh, let that simmer, run it back. I say we got a profit, and they tell me where you at. That's when I show them the Quran. You got and then they tell me I ain't fucking with the dancer. Silly Negro, please stop playing games. Time to rise, my G. The Roman solo, time to get down with the team. The great green arena on that other side. If you know what, if you know what I'm gonna. When I was in on the pilgrimage, I had close contact with Muslims whose skin would in America be classified as white and with Muslims who were themselves would be classified as white in America. But these particular Muslims didn't call themselves white. They looked upon themselves as human beings, as part of the human family, and therefore they looked upon all other segments of the human family as part of that same family. Now, uh, they had a different look or a different air or a different attitude than that which is uh, reflected in the uh, attitude of the man in America who calls himself white. So I said that if uh, Islam had done this, done that for them, perhaps if the white man in America would study Islam, perhaps it could do the same thing for him. I think what a lot of people are interested in, Malcolm, is whether this experience has made you feel that that your feelings have changed, that uh, that the animosity you have expressed in the past toward all whites. The one the thing that I want to make clear, clear, no matter how much respect, no matter how much uh, uh, recognition whites show toward me, as far as I'm concerned, as long as that same respect and recognition is not shown toward every one of our people in this country, it doesn't exist for me.